Do you know names of George Carlin, Dave Chappelle, Eddie Murphy, Bill Burr, Elsa, what's more here, uh, Bert Kreischer, Gabriel Iglesias, Louis C.K. Uh, and Eddie Murphy, do you know these names? Uh, yes, this video for you, my dear viewer, I'm a Russian man who learns uh, English through comedy and my own experiences. Let's uh, today talk about uh, comedians, com comedians in American culture, you know this this list maybe of comedians maybe don't know but I highly recommend to watch all of them it is some interesting like uh, specific order of fun yes and uh, today I will speak about them in the way how I describe them it is it means that uh, i'm a russian man i have uh, something maybe ideal maybe not ideal maybe a good comprehension of that people and i will talk about it i will look at this sometimes because we have names first of all we will start from gabriel iglesias gabriel iglesias it's a fuppy puffy <laughs> man with interesting sounds of woo and with the sounds of da, 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 with a different it is a cool voice over actor comedian i like them really so much it is maybe my first grade of uh, of uh, comprehension skills of this man it is so interesting to know this man because uh, he all he always speaks from my experience it is about my what i will talk about i will talk about what i watched I watched not whole videos of uh, these people and my opinion will be uh, uh, about my experience what I watched maybe I was watched was watched only one video and after that I will give you my expression about it my opinion about uh, Gabriel Iglesias he always speaks about uh, cops about uh, interesting moments in uh, drinking drunken or drugs uh, dealing with cops and with joking with them it is what i learned from th his stories and he's like a mexican burrito man i'll say it is interesting to know puto by the way spanish uh, to know puto puto <laughs> yes and next next person gabriel done is done next bill burr Bill Burr it is one interesting person who always uh, have uh, have this uh, elbow on his uh, or maybe not or palm on his uh, special stick for microphone it is always uh, crane for microphone and he always doing this like oh, I'm relaxing on it it is uh, interesting manner of uh, gestures Elsa I learned that he always speaks about uh, woman and uh, man that uh, woman is n is nobody and man it is so greatest race of uh, <laughs> that you ever heard or viewed yes it is uh, about his talk and uh, he, he is always smiling like a <laughs> like this way and it is funny bill burr one one interesting person too i like him and uh, else uh, he was speaking about politics a, a little bit but i know who speaks about uh, politics more he is uh, it is dave chapelle dave chapelle do you know it dave chapelle this uh, accident with uh, france uh, i forget his name uh, france uh, france man juicy juicy stolly and uh, he was speaking about him and uh, it was interesting but i did understand joke maybe he's speaking else about racism like a black white and different people it is interesting but it, it's not my so it is not for my heart dave chapelle it is not super like what i like the most it is good but not what i like else uh, he always uh, use his own stories I remember stories from ab about his son like uh, it it his story is so so empathizeful his stories it is like oh I feel the story so much it is uh, I feel his feelings when he's speaking it is interesting moments of him but I don't think that his joke is so funny maybe because I'm Russian 
It is not like his jokes uh, not good, because I am Russian and I don't understand it fully, because it is about politics. Next, Eddie Murphy. Eddie Murphy is this nice person who who has nice body language gestures. It is always dancing and it is cool Elsa voiceover. It is uh, like Gabriel Iglesias uh, plus uh, this kind of dancing dancer in one moment. It is nice pers person. I liked him from uh, Shrek and I like him on his comedians, uh, first comedian show, and it is so nice stand-ups. Next, Eddie Murphy done, Dave Chappelle done, Louis C.K. Louis C.K., I did understand him fully. He's about always uh, about racism, about sexual harassment things, about sex uh, and uh, <laughs> nothing else, because uh, I didn't watch uh, more videos. And he's uh, so understandable man. He speaks uh, clearly, I understand his accent, and uh, he's so nice to comprehend uh, to comprehend him, because I'm Russian and uh, I'm not a super English speaker to understand him, but it is so interesting to know about him too. George Carlin, oh Jesus, it is so powerful mindset of this man, he likes to Numer to do numeration of things. Not numeration, it means that he will about fruits. If he if he will speak about fruits, he will count it like a oranges, a watermelons, melons, uh, but faster. Oranges, uh, watermelons, melons, uh, ten tangerines, uh, f cucumbers, tomatoes, <coughs> different tools, and he will he will do this counting. It, it is something special from George Carlin. It's what Carlin. It is what you should learn from the from him. It is interesting, interesting type of. Uh, type of narration when he's always do this and on the last stage it is something oh jesus what is it the explosion of your mind after listening whole of it but he's so smart uh, rest in peace by the way he's smart and uh, else uh, he makes you to think about philosophical questions it is uh, really philosophical philosophical comedian I want to say and last but not at least it is Bert Kreischer Bert Kreischer it is I heard his two stories about Russia about machine and about ah, about dildos and about uh, this uh, what's about fighting a bear and uh, it was interesting to listen him and uh, I want to say that he is so uh, so, how to say, disgusting funny. Disgusting funny means that stories so disgusting. Stories are so disgusting and funny in the same time, but uh, you will laugh and hate in the same time. And uh, it is uh, not hate, he, not hate his personality, hate his story. Because, uh, Jesus, it is so disgusting to... Uh, I, it was... Uh, do you remember the story with, uh, how to say it, with licking, licking a bear with marshmallow? It was oh Jesus, so awful. And if his story is so true, it means that uh, oh Jesus Christ, he has so big experience of uh, some of dorky moments that so cringe moments, and uh, it is it is funny. I want to say every comedian has their own experience and it is so interesting to know and uh, you can recommend to your own comedians what you like please leave me in the comment section below it was my review of uh, seven one two three yes seven comedians what i like and uh, what i what i viewed also i like uh, one more like a jim carrey but i didn't watch his uh, stand-ups it is all stand-ups what i watched from American comedians, you can recommend more if you want. And thanks a lot for watching. Always stay tuned and always be funny and make your life more imaginable and laughable. Thanks so much. See you next time. Be strong. And you know, that all depends on you.
拜拜。